Hey guys, welcome back to another haul. I feel like I haven't done a haul in ages and I literally loved filming my last two. It was so fun and I'm glad that people like still love hauls because I love watching them. I love doing them and I love buying clothes as we all know. I just came back from my laser appointment and girl, I was literally lying on the bed, vagina spread with my legs on this woman's back. Um, <laughs> I just feel like I had to come on here and like, say that because like what was that um anyway let's go on with the haul i am so excited i feel like this is more like spring stuff i mean still stuff for like cold weather because england is fucking freezing like it's beginning of april and it is still frigid freezing cold outside and it's so windy and horrible today so yeah not a good start to spring is it but i feel like i've been buying more like spring vibe clothes so anyway i will just shut up and get started and showing you guys what i got so the first thing that i bought is this little like bonnet i guess you'd call it i got it from depop if i like talk about a depop shop or like a vintage seller or something i'll put that out on the screen so you guys can go check them out but i got this like knitted black bonnet with like little cat ears it is so fucking cute i wore it when i went to london and it fucking slayed. It was so cute. And the lady who I bought this off on Vinted was so lovely. She actually made it for me. She didn't have a black one on her shop. And I asked her to make it in black and she did. And oh, she was just so sweet. So first things first, this. I love little like fun accessories at the moment. Like cute hats, cute like little bonnets. I also have a teddy bear like hat which I love and I wear a lot because it's just so cute. We will start with tops. So the first two tops that I bought were from Uniqlo and I have been looking for just like a basic white t-shirt and a basic black t-shirt for the longest time. Not cropped, not like humongous, just like the perfect basic white and black t-shirt. And my brother had these ones from Uniqlo and I was like wait, like I tried it on and I was like wait this is perfect. So it is a Uniqlo um what is it even called? It's like Airism, I want to say. I'm going to have a look at the label so I can tell you the exact top. It's a Uniqlo Airism top. And this is my brother's one, I've just realised. I didn't have one in my drawer, so I went into my brother's bedroom to find my one. And I've just accidentally picked his one out because we both have the exact same ones. But, but yeah, I love this t-shirt. I love a basic white t-shirt. I literally have been wearing it so much. just feel like it goes with so much. And it is the softest nicest material like it feels so nice it just fits perfect and i feel like a white t-shirt like you can never go wrong like it goes with everything so i got it in white and then i also got it in black and i really want to get the black and white long sleeves as well because i feel like they will be really good to layer underneath clothes and again they are just like the literal perfect fit t-shirts like if you're looking for a good black and white basic t-shirt i definitely recommend getting these from uniqlo i think they were like 25 pounds each and they are so soft so nice and they again just fit amazing so just some basic t-shirts i just feel like they're such great like wardrobe staples and i didn't have any basic white and black t-shirts i have like crop tops but i wanted like a t-shirt you know next were the tops i got when i was in paris so went into weekday and i got two tops in weekday this one i haven't actually worn yet because it's a bit nipply to wear to work and it's a bit cold right now to wear this kind of a top but it's just this like white vest top i just really okay come on lighting i just really like the way the neckline was and the way just the way like it fit i didn't even try it on in the shop to be honest i just was like i think it's gonna fit me but i really like the neckline and the way the sleeves are i just think it's so nice and so flattering and again i really like weekday tops because they're not like especially those two that i bought they're not super cropped like you can like push them up so they're more cropped but you can also push them down so they're, they're a bit longer and i just feel like this is gonna be so cute with a little black skirt and again the quality and the material is so soft and then i also got this long sleeve black top from weekday which i've actually worn so much it's literally inside out but again, I just really liked the way that this looked like it would fit, like the neckline. Again, it wasn't like super cropped and you could make it, you could make it more cropped, you could have it longer. And I feel like recently I'm trying to get stuff which isn't like super, super cropped because I basically just have loads of crop tops. And I love a crop top, but sometimes I do want a bit of like longer material. 
so this top I mean it's gonna look like nothing as I'm just showing it's you now but in the trial you'll be able to see the way the neck is just so nice like I love like a neckline that is kind of like long and open it reminds me of like a ballet leotard and it fits so good and again the material is so soft I've already worn this loads like I knew I was gonna get loads of wear out of this especially because it reminds me of a bodysuit that I've got which it actually is a leotard and it's just so uncomfortable to wear so now I have this it's literally perfect and just looks so cute it's just a good basic I feel like recently I've just been trying to get more like good basic pieces that you can wear with anything so I got that and I also got this top when I was in Paris which again is going to look a bit weird as I'm showing it to you but you'll see it better in the try on it is this like gingham print and again I really love gingham print for like spring summertime I feel like it's going to be very in and I just think it's so cute but it's this kind of blouse with like these puffy sleeves and then at the front it ties up into three little bows and then it kind of has a little like peplum is that what you'd call it but I got this from a little shop in Paris it's called Bellarina if you wanted to look it up and see if they have like an online store but it was the cutest shop I had so I mean like nice cardigans I could really have popped off in there but yeah I just think this is gonna be so cute with jeans with a skirt for the summertime also reminds me of my next thing that I'm gonna show you so I just loved it I thought this is such a cute color as well the next thing I bought was like my first ever like big girl purchase I want to say like I mean I've spent a decent amount of money here and there on clothes shoes accessories but like this was like this is a moment for me, like I was so excited to buy this dress. Me and my mum went into London last month, we went into Ganny, and Ganny is one of my favourite like designer shops I want to say at the moment. Like a designer shop that like I possibly could buy things from. There are designers that I love that I'm like yeah, I will never be able to afford stuff from there. But Ganny is like, I could do that, like I could do that on a good day, do you know what I mean? So I'd been in a couple Ganny's before and I was like oh, I just love the stuff so much, like it's so pretty it's such nice quality it's so cute and I got this dress from Ganny because I saw it and I fell in love and also I was just thinking how cute it would be for Paris for the spring for the summertime for my little trips that I'm going on I'm just yeah I love it so much so it is this white Ganny dress and it is so cute like it is so cute I also tried the one on in black but I just feel like I've got so many black dresses and I was like come on like spring like get a white like white's cute and also you can like i feel like with a dress like this you can really do like so much to it like i when i was in paris i wore it with my purple black tights my like chunky black boots and i feel like it would even be cute over jeans and i just oh, i think it's so cute and then it ties at the front in three little bows and again i really love the sleeves and the way it fit and the way it looks i just couldn't not get it it made me feel like a little like fairy princess like dancing around in the woods and the fields and like with mushrooms and like squirrels and shit there's so many different ways you can style it which was another way that i like justified in my head to buy it because i was like well i could get like you know many outfit out of this the thing that i bought when i was in paris was this jumper me and sophie went into this vintage shop and it was such good prices i also bought like a long sleeve white well it's actually not white it's like lilac tight shirt but I'm gonna bleach it or like dye it so it's white because I didn't realize it was purple because the lights in the shop were weird but everything was so cheap like this jumper which is a Calvin Klein jeans like knitted jumper high neck like so soft so nice I'm literally obsessed with it it was actually 15 euros and for me I think that's a fucking great deal like I'm only comparing it to like Depop and like Brighton vintage shops and I feel like if this was in Brighton like down the lanes they would charge probably 60 quid for it so 15 euros I was like hey that's an offer one cannot pass up on and I love jumpers like this just like a simple black jumper and then the Calvin Klein jeans is in like a grey little box and I just love it it's so comfy so soft and you know I love soft clothes like that's one thing that's gonna like make or break a purchase for me if the material's nice or not if the material's not nice I'm not buying it I want to go back and just like go vintage shopping in Paris because I feel like they have so much nice stuff but you've really got to like be in the mood like you know when you're vintage shopping you've really got to lock in to like okay like I'm gonna have to be going for like rails and rails and rails of clothes but you know you're gonna find good stuff and it's cheap whereas in the UK when you go vintage shopping you see loads of nice stuff 
and then it's all like £100 and you're like oh like this isn't vintage shopping this is like designer shopping. Okay the last three things that I bought are skirts and oh I love them all literally so much like I love skirts at the moment. I never used to be a skirt girl. Recently I'm a skirt girl. I wear skirts and dresses more than jeans which I never used to say or I never used to want to do. First of all, this skirt is from Uniqlo and it's Uniqlo X Marnie. I got it off Depop and I'd seen it on Pinterest and I was like, oh yeah, that is a bit of me. I love it, so cute. I actually saw it on Enya and I was like, wait, love, like literally I need that skirt. So I found it on Depop and I fucking bought it. It's this Uniqlo Marnie puffball skirt, navy puffball skirt, long, just like literally gorge gorge a gorge skirt it's just so cute it fits so well it's so like flattering it reminds me of something from like the medieval times kind of but like in a cute fun way like I just love it so much I think it's so cute and again this is literally gonna be perfect for spring summer it's so cute next was a skirt which I got in Paris again in the same vintage shop this was actually three euros three euros and it is this long maxi velvet black velvet skirt i have wanted a black velvet skirt for so long i just think they're so cute and with docks and like loafers i feel like this is gonna be so cute and yeah i was like three euros you're literally coming home with me and i didn't even try it on and it fits perfectly so god was with me that day because sometimes i buy something just like eyeballing if it's gonna fit and it just like fits horrendously and then i'm like great now i've got to, like sell it or like wear it and just hate the fit so make sure you try your stuff on i just sometimes i just can't be bothered it's a lot of effort isn't it like getting your clothes off putting your clothes back on hell no but yeah this skirt fits so good and i'm so excited to wear it i just think it's so cute and you guys know that i love black like i love black clothing oh wait i'm all in black today a little bit of white but i just always wear black clothes so whenever i see something nice in black you're coming home with me. Another thing I bought was this skirt off Depop from Vivian Vintage, I think. And I've seen this skirt all over fucking Pinterest, all over TikTok, all over Instagram. And I was like, wait, their marketing is working because I'm sold. It was literally like the perfect looking black mini skirt. And I was like, wait, I need it. Because for me, a lot of skirts are too fucking short. Like I have this issue with like, so many of my like skirts that are meant to be like mini skirts no bitch my ass is hanging out yeah like why don't they make skirts for girls who are like smaller but like have a little ass like i have a little something there and like skirts don't accommodate for that like my whole cheeks i'm like cheeked up and they're out the cheeks are out and we're not doing that for free so this skirt i feel like is a good length like it's nearly showing the cheeks i'm not gonna like, it's grazing the cheeks but like the cheeks are hidden. I always have to wear shorts underneath skirts, underneath skirts, because, like, again, my ass cheeks are out, but the skirt, I just, I love it so much, and I also love it over jeans. Oh my god, just layered, it's just so cute. And it's just this black, like, wrap-around skirt, and then at the back, it ties into, like, a bow, which I just think is so cute, like, I love that detail. You can, like, tie it to the side as well, you can tie it in, like, however you want. But I literally got so much wow of this skirt. I'm so happy I bought it. And yeah, literally, if you're looking for like a good basic black skirt, this is literally perfect. Oh yeah, this is the brand. And I got it in a small. And it's just literally the perfect, perfect black skirt. That is everything for today. I really hope you have enjoyed. And if you want me to do more hauls, like subscribe so I can get more money and then I can film more hauls. Also, if like anyone wants to like send me free clothes, um yeah the offer's always open it's always there so yeah i love clothes so much and i'm so excited to like for it to actually get into like spring summer and sunnier so i can wear like summer clothes because i feel like that's my favorite time of year to dress like when it's not super hot but it's like warm enough to just wear a t-shirt and no jacket or like a really thin jacket i just love when it gets to that weather i'm like oh please can it come quicker i'm really hoping by the end of may when i go to cornwall it's gonna be like sunny maybe i can get tan wear a bikini who bloody knows like let's just be optimistic i really hope you enjoyed don't forget to give this video thumbs up comment subscribe Make sure to follow me on instagram 
follow me on tiktok everything's always linked down below and also make sure to follow my podcast on spotify and yeah hope you enjoyed this i've had so much fun filming it as i do with every haul and maybe i'll do another week of my outfits soon as well because i know you guys really like that liked that video as well anything clothing related you know i will be doing more of because i love it i love it so much anyway gonna go film the try on portion now probably lose like five years off my life doing it but i will see you next time with another new video bye